be an emergency, Claudia. Judging by your mood and your stench, I guess I pulled you away from Olivia, huh? What do you see in that old John? I don't get it. Hey, come on. Jax is trying to blackmail me. He knows that I'm responsible for getting Michael shot. Astrid Jerry Jax told his brother that I put it out in Sunny and that I'm responsible for getting Michael shot. Hmm. Well, obviously Jax kept his mouth shut or else he would not be six feet under by now. Well, he doesn't exactly want Carly to know on account she's having this whole risky pregnancy. Okay, then why did you see fit to drag me out here? A little support would be nice, John. Hey, how, how many people can know about a secret before it's not a secret anymore? Okay, you know what, Claudia? I was the one that told you months ago to bail, to get out of here, and you didn't. Now it's time to your pregnant with Sonny's kid, or Rick's kid. <laughs> Whose baby is it anyway, right? It's funny. Yeah. I'm up to my neck now in Sonny's business. So our only hope is to ride this out and have faith that it's in everybody's best interest that whoever's responsible for what happened to Michael stays a secret. Uh, this is a uh, bad time. I hate to interrupt you when you're brooding. No, no, I actually have the rest of the evening to meet my quota. Oh. Although that wasn't the plan. You're stood up. No. Duty called, thank you. Oh. Well, sorry, I hate it when that happens. Are you okay? Oh, yeah. Great. Better than great, actually. Though, I don't think you will agree with me. In fact, I suspect you'll think I'm crazy. Well, actually, I have a very high threshold for crazy these days. I don't think there's anything that you could say that would shock me. I asked me. Rebecca to move in with me. Except for that. Well, who am I to judge if... Rebecca is who makes you happy, then I'm all for it. <laughs> I appreciate that. Not sure you mean it, but I appreciate well, it. Well, I trust you to know what's best for your own life. Wow, that's refreshing. Thank you. See, I thought you were coming out here to warn me about all the reasons why it's weird and wrong and dangerous to be with Rebecca. Uh, yeah, actually, I, I came out here because I wanted to talk to you about Ethan. Really? What's he done this time? No, it's not him. It's actually the rest of us. I, I don't think that we've really welcomed him with open arms. Lucky's been openly hostile and Dad's disappeared, and I think that's what's thrown Ethan completely back. I think he thought he finally found a real connection, and then Dad disappeared like a bat out of hell. It sounds a lot like the way everyone's been treating Rebecca, like she's done some, something wrong, like she can actually help the circumstances of her childhood, you know? Must be hard on both of them.